We need some help. Alright, shoot. Now, uh, this is dealing with a phony seal corman. He's a terrible, despicable little sack. And I'm going to YouTube <laughs> some of this, so I have a, a couple of questions to ask you. Uh -huh. Now, you're a retired medical doctor. Right. And you were also a corpsman in the Navy. I was. And you were with the Marines in Korea. That's right, 13 months. And how many Purple Hearts did you get with the Marines in Korea? One. And then you went to SEAL Team and fought during Vietnam. Great tours. And how many Purple Hearts did you get with SEAL Team? I think it was four, but it might have been five. I don't really remember. So if uh, we lined up a North Korean or a Chinese guy and a Vietnamese guy and a phony SEAL, which one would you shoot first? The phony SEAL, of course. <laughs> That's it. Yeah. Did Doc, when... I, might, I, might just, I might line them up in tandem and then shoot the, the first one, be the Navy SEAL, and I hope the bullet would go through the other two. <laughs> <laughs> in Afghanistan, and uh, where the majority of uh, Team Five was taken out, because that was the second crash. Actually, Team Five crashes over there. Look, listen, listen, you, James, fucking listen up, dickhead. Class one ninety nine graduated nineteen ninety five. The same year you're talking, you graduated high school. You're not listed in the SEAL database. I'm a retired Navy SEAL. I see this. Team 5 had nothing to do with any helicopter crashes. There is no guy named Alderman listed. Uh, I verified you real quickly uh, through that because I'm a retired Navy SEAL. You should Google me and see what I do to dickheads like you uh, to steal valor from SEALs. And I don't think Flippin' Luttrell is going to like uh, you talking about him uh, and his water skills. Because your 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 name is Jim Madison, but your nickname is Mad Dog, and I'm about to see if you live up to that. Okay, so I want you to listen to me very closely. James Hoskins stole the class picture and the identity of Brett Shadle, who was killed in a parachute jump at Dev Group. Now, how does that make you feel? understand you're a disabled Navy SEAL. Yes. I'm a retired SEAL. Uh, I'm not finding any listing of you in the SEAL database as ever being a Navy SEAL. Can you help me out with some of that? We'll straighten that all out. Sure. I was with SEAL Team 5 and graduated with 099. You graduated high school in 1996. 95. Did you know that Bud's class 99 graduated in 1978? No. Yeah, well, yeah, it did. There's no listing of you up there. What's that? There's no listing of you up there under class 99. In fact, there's no listing of you in the SEAL databases ever being a Navy SEAL. Oh, yes, there was. Mm, I'm a retired if SEAL. And... My face, if, you, if you look at my Facebook page, uh, there is a foreigner, and right to the left of that is me. And what Bud's class is that, 99? Yes. No, that's 236. That's Mike Murphy's okay. Bud's class. That guy, do you know who that guy is in the... Murphy. Yeah, I knew who Lieutenant Murphy was. Not the guy in the black hat. No, not the black hat. The, the guy that was wearing the, uh, the off-color uniform. Yeah, the dark uniform? Yeah, right. Do you know who that is? That picture is class 236. That's Mike Murphy. A number of those guys are killed in that class. It's not class 99. Well, I'm saying, well, Lieutenant Murphy was actually on the ground when, when he uh, went up to go uh, uh, make a call for help. Yeah. That is the officer Nook. Took out over half my, uh, half my platoon and half my team. Really? They were on that stopper. Really? Yeah. And, what uh, team Michael was that from? Trail. From Team 5? Yeah. Team 5? Yeah, Marcos Luttrell was 
Philadelphia was my. Uh, I also helped train uh, Mark Wilson-Trell with Seal Team Tigers former. State your purpose. My purpose is this. I am out to down dog on phony fucking Navy SEALs just like my bro. Don Shipley of Extreme SEAL Experience. And that is a joint mission. And we mean to dog on take out every dipshit, scumbag, shitbag, fucking cheese dick on this planet that claims to be a Navy SEAL and isn't. That's our mission. And if you contact uh, Mark Wilson-Trell's family, they'll also back up the fact that I was with, uh, uh, with SEAL Team Cyrus. How was Marcus as a student? Was he easy to teach or was he a, a kind of a dumb guy? Well, Trell? Yeah. No, I honestly, uh, even though I have a PhD in medical science, or molecular science, basically. Uh, it was actually easier and smarter than me. The only difference was, was uh, he kind of panicked. Um, he had more panicking underwater um, than, uh, um, than most people did when we were doing the, uh, the underwater training. So, um, but um, he just didn't like being tied up. It was a subtle. Well, I thought you were training him as a corpsman. You were his buds instructor? We did, but we were all... No, but when we... Uh, he, he was having issues with uh, jump school, and then he was also having issues with, um, with the swim claws. He's a lurker. He's, he reads, he looks, and he's a big fucking fat, loudmouth, goofy bastard, and I'm gonna fucking end him. Bam! No, is that, is that Marcus? Yeah. Let me take the, let me take the thunder, Don, real quick. Oh, yeah, Marcus wants his name. Hey, dude, how you doing? He sucked in the water. I said he struggled in the water when he was, when he was tied up. But he no, struggled. The only thing I was good at was being in the water, sir. You know, when you had your hands tied behind your back and your legs tied up, the first couple times in, you were you panicked a little bit, but I'm not saying you weren't good in the end. The first couple times you did panic. You don't remember that? Because I was a corpsman on duty. I said I never had my hands and feet tied after blood. If I did have after blood, the hamster did panic. And I damn sure didn't panic at first thing. Oh yeah, you panicked slightly because it because it was written down. If you if you pull a cure. Uh, uh, your performance chart, I guarantee it's marked. Uh, when I came back from a mission in the, uh, uh, from the Middle East, and um, I came back and went on a uh, uh, halo jump out in California, and um, that's when I got injured, and that's how I got my 100% disability was I had hit the ground at some of velocity. And if you've seen pictures of me next to George W. Bush giving, giving me medals. No. Have you ever looked me up and, and seen where... Um, and where would that uh, be? Vice Admiral Tracy actually came all the way out to San Diego and gave me a medal. And where would also, that... Uh, the uh, the uh, McPong actually gave me a medal, came in and gave me my purple heart, my last one. Your last one? How many purple hearts did you get? I got three. You got three? He's got the head the size of a fucking pumpkin. He's claiming all this shit about you being weak in the water, team five in snow drifts, and graduating with Murphy. He can't get his buds class right. And all these uh, people pinning awards on him. Every physician will tell you that the, uh, uh, the injury I suffer
We're talking about some shit that you're not even a part of or want to be a part of just so you can boost your morale when you head out to the local bar. No, I never once even tried to do that. You know what? Matter of fact, I never even wanted to do that. You don't even trust me. I don't right, hear everybody that helped me. When you go through our training, the guys that you go through the training with and the instructors, you remember every single one of them. First name, last name. You don't be throwing those. HM, this, that, the other, you tell his full name, last name, and his name, okay? You need to quit all this shit before you get hurt, dude. I'm telling you, man. If you keep going down the road, somebody's going to find you and fuck you up. I'll see you, doctor. <laughs> all right, Marcus. Thanks, bro. You got to be impressed that I was able to uh, speed dial Latrell, huh? How about that? There is no way to tell the twisted story of uh, James Hoskins' phony SEAL claims in just a single video. It's going to take two of them. In part two, James's military records come back when I requested them. They tell a different story than James does. Here's scenes from part two of James Hoskins' phony Navy SEAL of the week. You're a big lumpy prick. And you post up a bunch of shit. You're as fucked up as ten fucked up motherfuckers, dude. It's uh, stop with uh, the CIA to hunt down Bin Laden in the, the late 90s. Uh, you know, I had a couple of friends that had been killed in the Middle East. Uh, and I was going to ask you, and then we got some asshole that has been in the military for all of two months before he got kicked out. Which, James Luttrell, you are not. <laughs> His name, not James Luttrell. Oh, shit. <laughs> How about this? Tomorrow, late afternoon, we can call John McCain, and he can back me up. Uh, you're not disabled from a halo drop. I'll see you. Oh, yeah, definitely. Well, you're giving me a fucking headache, and I need a drink. Me driving the other you day. Hitting a goose. I didn't hit the goose. I did not hit the goose. There's the how it's do you hit. not see a goose? That's how I was sitting over there in the it's, cheap seats. That's all you've got to do is just look straight ahead. But I was driving and I was looking off to the left. It's a pretty scenery. And then he's like, hey, Diane, there's a goose. I didn't hit it. But then you almost grabbed a hold of my steering wheel and screamed at me because I was about to hit a snake. Well, I you run don't over. See things in I the road. saw that how snake. Do you, how do you drive? I meant to run like over that goose. snake. That goose was going. Oh my god! That I'm like Diane. You don't see the. You don't see the. You don't see that goose. <laughs> it wasn't that Getting bad. out of the way. You damn near hit the guy with the road sign.